Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm really excited to be taking you with us along through our nighttime routine. If you guys are new here, my name is Mackenzie. I am a single mom to a three-year-old little crazy boy. This is Jace. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> Jace and I's dad separated about a year ago and honestly we have not had much of a routine since then. George. I think most of it has just been about George. surviving. But I'm starting to realize that we really need to figure out bedtime. We have been co-sleeping for the last year. And so I have been trying my best to get Jace to start sleeping in his own bed. And creating a solid bedtime routine has been a huge part of that. Me and his dad are both also trying to get on the same page regarding it so that transition days aren't so hard. Jace is with me five nights. This was dad's for three nights. And whenever he comes home, he's definitely wild and sometimes cranky. And so we just think that having a cohesive schedule, especially at bedtime, will help him out with that. So this is a pretty new schedule for us. To be honest, I don't know how tonight is going to turn out. It may go great. It may not. But this is real life. This is reality. So I'm going to show you some of the stuff we do. Some of it we've always done. Uh, and some of it's kind of new. The part basically where he starts sleeping in his own bed by himself and falls asleep on his own. That's the hard part. So if you guys are new, make sure to click that subscribe button and like the video if you do, and let's get right into it. Okay, so it is currently 6.52, so almost seven o'clock. Seven o'clock is when we kind of begin his bedtime routine, and the goal is to have him ready for bed by eight o'clock and him falling asleep hopefully shortly thereafter. That's the goal. That's what we try to stick to. We're, I'm definitely not super strict about routine. Like if we're at my parents' house and we're having a good time, I let him stay up past his bedtime. That's okay, I don't rush off from places. But I need him to at least have like a schedule like of knowing what we're gonna do at night. And if the time changes a little bit, I'm okay with that. JC, we're gonna start. Our bedtime routine. <gasps> da -da -da -da. So, what are we gonna do first? You wanna have a bath? Um, I want to we... play. Yeah, we can play. Let's play in the bath. Okay. I'm gonna start the bath. We definitely don't have a bath every single night. Jace has always had super sensitive skin and so by his doctor's recommendation was to not bathe him too often and that we just kind of stuck with that as he's gotten older. But we probably give him a bath every few days. Um, he's a pretty clean kid so honestly he's not like playing in the dirt or the mud. That's just not who he is so um, I anticipate we'll have to start bathing him more and more as he gets older. But for now, every other day, every few days, yeah. So the goal with bath time is not just to get clean, but to get out a lot of energy so he gets a lot of play time. Um, I pretty much just let him chill for as long as he wants. And then when he's ready to get out, that's when I will actually clean him. Jace hates getting the soap in his hair washed out, so I actually take him out of the bath and then 
turn on fresh water and then just rinse his hair out while I'm holding him outside the bath. He just prefers that more. Caleb like does not like water on his face. Um, so that's pretty much what we do. Can't seem to keep control All the laughter hides the pain I've gotta go, I've gotta go, I've gotta go find my soul This kid will say anything to get out of bed So we are gonna have a quick snack and I'm going to fill up your water. What do you want for a snack? Do you um, want a banana? Do you want a fruit bar? Yes, a fruit, a fruit bar. bar. Okay. A fruit bar. And He's so obsessed with these little fruit source bars. And I'm going to eat your fruit bar, guys. <laughs> eat your fruit bar. And mommy will fill it up with water and I. Now that we've had our snack, Time to brush our teeth, right? Oh, so we get no germs. Huh? We don't want germs. Show me your teeth. Oh, they're dirty. So as you can see, Jay still has a lot of energy and our house actually gets a ton of light. So I actually go ahead and shut all the blinds upstairs so that it starts to get dark so that he knows it's time to start winding down and getting ready for bed. My room. But um, this stairway window brings in a ton of light, sometimes copper. Parks at people, so you're going to close that one. And then it's a lot darker up here. Next is I like to get Jace to help me put away his toys. We haven't been home much actually today, so the house isn't that messy. I do cleaning after he goes to bed, but I like him to help me a little bit with his toys. I just can't this kind of I need you to help me clean clean up some of your toys. We always like have a ton of stuff on the stairs, so I'm just gonna get him to take his stuff that goes into his room and then the rest I will do later. Come up here. What books do you want to read? I'm going to let him pick out a couple books. Sometimes it's reading books. Sometimes oh. it's... Um, um, but we're not going to do um, that tonight. We're going to just read books. One. He tends to go this to sleep one. better. Okay, and you can pick one more. Okay. Uh, he tends to go to sleep better when we just read books. Oh, but, so you know, fun. sometimes he does need the to get him a little bit more mellow and ready for bed. I think as a mom, you just gotta do the best you can do. If some days it's books, great. If some days it's screen time, that's okay too. That's not my dinosaur. What? Because it have sharp teeth. It's teeth are too bumpy. bumpy. Do you want me to sing your song? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Daddy turns the light off as he tucks me into bed. He kisses me before he goes. And wait! No, you know 
lot of fun. Oh. Yeah, I'll with you for a couple of minutes. And you free with me in a little oh, bit now. I'll lay with you for like a couple minutes, okay? Okay. It is 8.55. Um, Jace is asleep. This is, this is real life, but he did not want to go to bed um, without me. So I just played with him for a little bit, which I normally do. But I actually kind of dozed off. <laughs> so I don't know exactly when he fell asleep, but I woke up and he was snoring. Normally I like to leave his room before he falls asleep. I just lay with him and then once he's actually starting to get really tired, that's when I tell him I'll be right back to check on him and I leave. And then usually he'll stay in bed. But obviously today didn't work out like that. Um, I'm really tired. So this is probably gonna be like an early night for me as well, but once I've left Jace's room, I usually do a little bit of cleanup before I get into my own little night routine. I think I will probably do another video going a bit more in depth about what I do on my side so I just gave you a little sneak peek um, maybe a skincare routine I don't know we'll see let me know down in the comments make sure to give this video a like and subscribe if you haven't already and we'll see you in the next one bye